I'm going to show you how to use the split screen feature. It's a multitasking feature on your Samsung Galaxy S22, S22 Plus, or the S22 Ultra. So you can basically have like one side like a, watching a YouTube video, the other side you can have uh, emails and you can reply to emails, read emails, you can comment on a YouTube video and so on. Now most apps you can do split screen, okay, but there are a few that you're not going to be able to use um, split screen, right, on some of the apps. So anyway, let's go ahead and get this started. So first thing to note is if you look on the left, the uh, top left hand side here, see that little white line on the screen? If we slide that over to the left, this is our multitasking bar. Now we see a little line right here. Everything above that is your most recent apps that you opened, okay? And down here, these are uh, pre-installed apps here. Now we can always change these apps down here, okay? Like uh, put your main apps in there. You can just click on the three horizontal lines down here and choose edit. And then you can add your main apps you want down here, okay? So to start like split screen, the first thing we got to do is open up one app that we know that we definitely want on the split screen. So for example, uh, just say the Play Store here, that's one of them that I want. Let me just open that up. Okay, now I have that open up. Now if I use the multitasking bar, I can slide over and now I can go ahead and add another app in there. So let's say this YouTube app in here I want. So I'm going to press and hold, long press, press and hold, and now move over. I can put it on the bottom here. I can put it on the top. I can even put it on the middle here, which is a pop-up view, which I'll show you in a second, okay? But let's just do this. Let's put the YouTube video on top right there. So we got our, our YouTube app, and we've got a Google Play Store. Of course, you can always uh, rotate it as well, and you have this middle line here. You can go ahead and increase or decrease each side. You can even go ahead and play a YouTube video. So you can watch a YouTube video here. Of course, you can go in and you can comment, reply to comments. We can press that little right there to make it full screen on the half of the screen right there. We can put it on pause. Now we can also do this too. Let's say we wanted to replace like uh, one of the uh, split screen apps like Google Play. We can go ahead and open up the multitasking bar. And let's say that we want to go ahead and replace this something that's not on here, okay? If it's not on here, no problem. What you got to do is tap the three lines down here, tap on all apps, and then find an the app that you want. For example, let's just do the uh, photos gallery here. So what you want to do is press and hold the app that you want, press and hold, and then move it to replace it where you want it. So I'm going to drop it down here. So now I got my gallery down here and my YouTube up there. Now let's do something with the pop-up menu. You know, let's say you wanted to go ahead and bring up something really quickly. Let's bring up the multitasking view here or the uh, multitasking bar. And then let's say we want like to put the clock on the pop-up. We can click on the three lines down here and then click on all apps. And then let me find my clock is right here. So I can go ahead and press and hold. Now instead of replacing one of these, I can just put it right here in the middle. So something important, we can go ahead and put that in the middle right there. Okay, and if you want to get rid of it, just go ahead and click the back button there. And also, if I close this, if I close it, I can open it back up, okay? Just click on the Recents menu, the three vertical lines down here, tap on that, and then we can see our Recents menu up here as well. And here's that split screen. We can tap on that and bring that back. If you want only the YouTube on here and get rid of the bottom app, we can just go ahead and slide it all the way down, just like that, okay? Pretty simple. Questions or issues, just uh, comment below.